taking over the world one nerd at a time. Total Nerd Takeover. Hello, Chris Gray from TNRT.com, and today we're going to be talking about the selfie cam lens. That's right, a clip-on lens that's very inexpensive because we all love to take selfies, don't we? So on my travels, I was at a Five Below store, and I saw this selfie cam lens kit. It was for five bucks. I figured, let me grab this and check it out because who doesn't want to have better selfies, right? I mean, the iPhone camera or whatever smartphone camera you're using has a great camera on it, but having a lens really makes a big difference. First thing I want to mention is for the iStyle selfie, <laughs> selfie cam lens, the packaging is a pain in the backside. Um, trying to rip through this thing, it's like trying to open an old Sony Walkman. Um, I actually cut, stabbed myself in the finger trying to break through this, this plastic. It's like, look, it's only a $5 lens, people. I, I don't need to kill myself trying to get it out. That being said, throw that on the floor, pain in the butt to open it up. But for 5 bucks, this is a great little kit. It has a plastic clip so that you can clip your uh, your lens onto your smartphone on the front or the back. And the lens, it's I, I believe it's glass. I can't tell if it's glass or plastic. It's encased in this aluminum uh, shell. So the body of it is actually aluminum, and then the clip itself is plastic. I just hope it doesn't break over time. I don't take a lot of selfies, so maybe it won't. It's also, you can unscrew it and remove it. So you can get a, uh, I don't know, you can get in there and clean it out a little bit better. But you can actually get in there with a Q-tip as is, so I don't know why you want to take it off. But you can take the plastic clip off. Um, feels pretty solid. Aluminum has the writing. This is a super wide lens. And all it does, take your smartphone, clip it on the front, and there you go. Now you can take, now you can take selfies. And what it does is it gives you a wider angle. So when you're taking a regular picture, It'll be, you know, a selfie square kind of right in your face. Bam, selfie. But if you want to get some of the background, if you want to kind of offset yourself a little bit, which they say is a better and more interesting picture to kind of give yourself, um, I think it's quarter of the screen or something like that, so people can also see a little bit of background. Uh, well, this thing here will give you a lot of background. Um, it's also great for when you're trying to take a, a, a wider panoramic shot. And you can even put it on the rear camera rear side facing camera just like that what else comes in this five dollar kit um, it comes with this uh this bag it feels velvety on the outside feels cheap on the inside but i mean it's five bucks it's a little bag no big deal you can also use it to clean the lens and it actually uh you know it's a nice little holding bag the worst part about this lens that i've seen is the lens protecting cap um, that comes with the kit it is very tight and very difficult to get on you really have to work it around and I'm always afraid I'm going to break something but once you get it on there once you get it on there like that it'll protect your lens put your lens in the bag pull the drawstrings and you're ready to put it in your pocket in your tech bag in a pouch bag in a briefcase in a purse a pocketbook whatever you got uh, you want to hang it around your neck like an ornament that's fine too so you always have your selfie lens cam but I got to say for five dollars at the five below store I, I thought it was a good price and it, it didn't interfere with the pictures. The pictures came out wide and nice. The only thing that looked a little bit strange is when I was doing some videos on the Periscope Twitter app, it was giving me this rounded bubble effect um, in, a, in a tighter enclosure like when I was in my truck. Um, not a big deal. I mean, you know, I'm not going to be going out shooting comic conventions with this thing. Um, although I bet you I could get some really nice wide angle pictures with it at a kind of comic book convention. Hmm. I'll let you know. But take a look at this. We're going to show you some pictures so you can see the difference between having the lens on and off. And I just want to mention that I never changed. When I took these pictures, I did not change the distance. I just took the I, I took a picture with it on. I took it off. Or I took it on and took it off. Whatever. Vice versa. However. But I never changed the distance from the subject I was shooting. So now you can get a look at what this camera, what this camera lens kit can do.
All right, so my final verdict, well, that's it's easy. Five bucks, it's a no-brainer. If you like to take a lot of selfies and you like to do a lot of uh, cell phone photography, nothing wrong with getting a couple of these things. It's cheaper than an Clip, although I would like to get Clip to send me a review unit that they'll ever respond to my email. That would be wonderful. I know that they're very busy. Um, I'm going to be trying to get some more of these, um, you know, these clip-on camera lenses to review to see if they're worth your money. So thank you for subscribing to the channel. Thank you for your comments and questions. If you have any more, you know where to put them. I also want to remind everyone we don't just do videos. We also do podcasts. We do five different podcasts here at Total Nerd Takeover Studios. We have a podcast all about Apple products and getting you more educated on how to use them and giving you tips and tricks and advice and news and all kinds of stuff with Apple. We have a movie review podcast mostly nerd movies, called Nerd Theater. We also have a Game of Thrones podcast called Behind the Iron Throne. And uh, if, you can't get your, if you haven't gotten enough Game of Thrones yet, check out that podcast. You'll laugh, you'll cry, you'll have a good time. We also have our flagship podcast, Teener T. And we have a video game podcast. We do all kinds of different stuff. Check out our website at teenerd.com. And if you would like to support everything we do here at Total Nerd Takeover Studios, you can buy this hoodie or a hoodie of your choo choosing. If you want to have a really awesome looking hero or villain or superhero gear or villain gear, check out the affiliate link in our description to superherostuff.com and you can look the part of a superhero or a villain because, you know, if you don't have the gear, you, you, can't, you can't be a hero or a villain. I'm just saying. Check it out in the description. Okay, see you guys next time.